Well, this is a big update to a story we first brought you as breaking news back on Friday. That's when we learned John Falcicchio was no longer in his position as D.C. Deputy Mayor and Chief of Staff. Just about two and a half hours ago, we got a statement into our newsroom from the attorneys of a woman accusing Falcicchio of, quote, long-standing sexual harassment. Our chief investigative reporter, Eric Flack, has been digging into this story hours before it broke on Friday. And Flack, you were hearing that Falcicchio's mysterious departure may be related to this. And now, today, attorneys for the alleged victim are going on the record. Yeah, we sure did, Lorenzo. And while many of the details of what is being alleged remain unclear, we now know the mayor's chief of staff and right hand since she took office eight years ago resigned under a cloud of sexual harassment allegations and is the subject of an investigation by the Office of Legal Counsel. Let's read this statement. We got into our newsroom just about 2.30 this afternoon from the alleged victim's attorneys. Quote, we represent an employee of the District of Columbia who came forward to report serious allegations of sexual harassment by former Chief of Staff and Deputy Mayor for Planning and Economic Development, John Falcicchio. It is our understanding that this behavior is longstanding and our client is cooperating fully with the investigation, which Mayor Bowser initiated immediately. Our client is courageous. She came forward to ensure accountability and protect other women. Given the gravity of our client's allegations, which involve unwelcome advances and sexual contact, we ask the media to respect her privacy. The statement also encouraged anyone else affected to quote, contact the mayor's office of legal counsel. The mayor addressed Falchico's abrupt and to many shocking dis departure for the first time earlier today, citing privacy concerns. Mayor Bowser said only she found out about the allegations against Falchicchio on Thursday and he turned in his resignation the next day. The mayor said she immediately opened an investigation which would be handled by the mayor's office of legal counsel. When asked directly if her investigation was focused on sexual misconduct of any kind, the mayor declined to comment. Here's what the head of her office of legal counsel did say. The scope of the investigation is based upon the sensitive matter. I, I will tell you it's not jargon, but there are privacy concerns. Uh, as any investigation that our office undertakes, we follow our standard policies and procedures, which include um, confidentiality and uh, the integrity of the witnesses and anyone who can come forward and speak. The mayor said at her press conference today, it is her expectation all staff will cooperate with this investigation. There are no indications this is a criminal matter right now, but the head of the mayor's office of legal counsel said that if that changes, the investigation would be turned over to law enforcement. More to come, guys. Yeah, it sounds like this investigation into Falchicchio is just beginning and you're going to stay on top of it. Flack, you thank it. you.